how's it going? In this super quick video, I'm gonna show you how you can make your very own Instagram ad. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is make sure that you have a professional Instagram account. Otherwise, you're not gonna be able to boost your posts on Instagram. And hey, if you don't know how to do that, you can check out our very own tutorial on how to switch to your professional Instagram account just down in the description below. So once you've logged into your professional Instagram account, you're gonna to wanna to click on your profile here and then find the post that you wanna promote. I'll select this wedding video here and you'll see I have an option in the bottom right hand corner here to boost the post, so I'll click that. From here, Instagram will take you to this menu where you have to actually set all the parameters for your targeted ad. So first off is the goal. What kind of conversion are you looking to gain from this paid Instagram ad? You can have your CTA send people to your profile on Instagram if you'd like more followers or more engagement or something like that. You can even send people to your website if you want to look for more bookings, try to gain a little bit more contact information. You can even have Instagram target something like DM so you can try and get more people to DM you to maybe try and start a conversation and book clients that that way or if you want you can set multiple different CTAs at a given time for this ad I'm gonna say that I want people to visit my profile I want them to find out about me and potentially book me for their video jobs so I'll hit next and then you'll see that I have an opportunity to set my audience now you have to be sure that whatever you're advertising is not in the employment housing social issue elections or politics side of things as those posts are subject to special regulation when it comes to paid advertising on Instagram I don't have to worry about that, so I can either select the suggested audience for Instagram, which will pick a rough estimate of what they think that my video would be best targeted for, or I can create my own audience. Since I have my own wedding video business, I have already set my own audience here so that whenever I make a paid ad or a promotion, I can just select this and it will instantly send out to men and women ages 18 plus in my area who are interested in brides, weddings, everything like that. But how do you make that? You can make your own. So go to create your own and you can select your own targeting options. I recommend using Advantage Plus because Instagram automatically updates your terms to be a little bit more relevant to your audience. If you find it's not really working out for you, you can always turn this back back off, but for the meantime, I'd stick with that on. So I'll name my audience something, I'll call it best audience. And then from here, I'll select my location that I wanna target with this paid ad. I'm gonna select the country of France, I'll hit next. And then I'll, you'll see here the estimated audience size. So this is gonna capture 24 million to 28 million potential audience. So I'll hit done. And there you go, the location is already set. Hey, all this boosted ad stuff is pretty great, but what if you had a platform which allowed you to see your Instagram posts, everything they have scheduled out, see your boosted posts, see it all, all in one platform. You got it, it's Agora Pulse. Check it out in the description below for a free trial today. From here you can set your age limit for your ads. Now this is only really useful if you're selling something like alcohol or something that is only permitted for people over a certain age. Really, if you do it and you don't have any need for that restriction, you're just limiting the amount of reach that you're gonna get from your paid ads. So I'll just leave it at the minimum age. I'll hit done. And then I can see here audience suggestions. You can go into things like age and gender, you can select a specific age range. Perhaps your audience is a little bit on the older side that you're targeting. Well, you can change that. I'll say that people 45 and up are my estimated audience in France. I'm selling to those people specifically, and I'm selling to uh, only women in this case. So I'll select that, I'll hit done, and there you go, it's very, very targeted. I find the best results on Instagram are when you target things accurately. Maybe promoting your business to all of France is something that works for you, but maybe getting a little bit more granular saying, hey, women ages 45 to 65 in Paris would be a great fit for what I am selling. And honestly, I find that provides better results. From here, you can select their interests. I'll say cycling. I'll say running. And yeah, I'll say swimming. Why not? So there you go. As you can see, each different thing that I add on in terms of interest, you'll see that the estimated audience size is growing. So again, you can just sort of get that in the range that you want in order to hopefully get the maximum amount of conversions. So I'll hit done. And there you go, I set this up perfectly. It's women in France, age 45 to 65, who are interested in cycling, swimming, and running. Now I'll hit done. I'll make sure my best audience, the audience I just created is selected. I'll hit next. 
And there you go. Now you can actually select your budget and your duration. So from this page, I'm going to set my budget and duration. And this is maybe the most difficult thing for you to nail down because it really depends on what works best for you and what you find is driving the most conversion. So it's really trial and error because you're going to have to set your daily budget as well as the duration. So I find that if you set your duration to, so let's say 30 days, but then your daily budget to the minimum of $3 daily, it doesn't really make as much sense, but maybe it works for you. Who knows? Likewise, I don't know if spending $412 in one day is necessarily the smartest option either. So you're going to want to find kind of a happy medium. Let's say that I choose $12 daily budget for the next five days. It'll be $60 and we'll try that out. And you can see down here, it even gives you the estimated reach for the given time period. I'll hit next. And from here, you just have to input your name for tax related purposes, hit confirm, and then you will pay. And there you go. Your post will be live. Finally, it's worth noting as well that you can always boost a post after you post it, like I just showed, or you can boost a post as you're posting it. So you can see here, I've got this photo of my dog. Let's say I want to boost it and advertise it right at the beginning. I can just hit on more options here, and then you'll see there's an option to boost posts, and then it will go into the ad settings once you go to the next page of your post. And lastly, you can always click on view insights to see your insights in real time to see how things are performing with your ad and if people are liking it. So there you have it. That's how you create your very own Instagram boosted ad. Stay tuned because we've got lots of great content coming your way all the time.